Hello and welcome to a little look at the latest patch update 1.11 from Giants and a couple of little problems that I have found. Now I have already downloaded the and installed the the upgrade but if you just hang on a second you'll see that we're getting the information from the update server which is the way it normally shows when I start up the game basically and in a little while it will give us it will tell us that there's an update to be installed I don't know if anybody else is having this basic problem but this is not what I really want to look at but I thought I'd just show it to you as well I'll get through to when it eventually comes up all, all servers are down so <laughs> many people are having problems by the looks of things in any case I'll opt out of that right and you can see up there already installed but it was looking to try and install it again in any case yeah so there have been many reports on problems with not being able to use the build mode and many people have isolated it down to to a mod conflict so what I thought was is I needed to check up to see whether my especially my main game, my New Hope Realistic Farming mod, mod whether it was affected or not. So I did go in and and we'll start it up. We'll start and we'll have a look and see. So let's just go into the build mode and yeah as you can see I do have some sort of problem can't go into the build mode at all so the easiest as we know it's a mod conflict so the easiest way to determine what mod it is is to I suppose first of all listen to what the other people have said and try those first but I'll just go through how I when I do have mod conflicts how I do it and I know a lot of other people do it the same way so the first thing that I will do is I will go into my settings and I'll make sure that my auto save is off. Right, so you don't want to save after you've you want to be able to go back to where you've come into the game every time after you've done the 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 following tests that we're going to do. So if we get out of that, so we know we're going to go back to where we started before we came in. And we exit the game. Don't save the game, just quit the game. I'm sure everybody knows this, but still, just make sure. And then say, do you want to end this game without saving? Yes, you do want to. And then go through the start up again. So we go to career. career. So what I do now is you can see all the mods that we do have installed. So there's quite a few of them. Right, so what I would do is I would go down to put the cursor down sort of middle halfway down. So let's go to there. Right, make a note of where you've gone down to. So, JCB, Fast Track. I'm going to deselect all of these. And further down, so from... Deselect it. So what we're doing now is we are going to see whether we have the same problem without these mods. If we do have the same problem, or if we don't have the same problem, should I say, then we know that the problem mod is in this section of the gate of our mod list. It's a little bit tedious, but it's quicker than doing them one by one, that's for sure. And theoretically it could be 
any of these. From the videos that I have watched from other content creators is that it does seem to be a number of mods that are affected. Right, so now we know that we were up to the JCB Fast Track. Where, where is it? There we go. Okay, so we know we've that's where we started. So anything above that, I suppose we could work out that we need to start from the herdsman stick, but that's where we actually deselected from. So that's as long as we as long as you can just note down where you are. So we then start the game. And we go in, wait for it to load. We'll get back to you once we're in the game. Right, so here we go, we're back in the game. Let's have a look and see. So we've still got a problem. So we know that the mod that is creating the problem is not in the in the bottom half. So all those mods that we've deselected, that's not, none of those are creating the problem. So we'll escape and we will exit so make sure you don't save your game and we quit right so now we are back out and we can go down to jcb fast track should still be selected now JCB fast track so we know we deselected those so now we go back and we deselect these up here okay, just get through all of these right so when we get up to here I'm going to obviously I can't take out new hope but I'm going to leave the realistic farming on the only reason why I haven't updated it here is because I updated it um, directly from from github so I know that I am at this point in time on the most um, up-to-date uh, mod there so I just don't want to re redo it let's put it that way so let's have a look and see if of course we if we um, get to the stage where this doesn't sort it out, then we pr can pretty much be sure that it's going to be the realistic livestock mod. But let's ha let's have a look and see. Let's go into the let's start the game, and once we're in, we'll get back to you. So let's have a look and see. And now our sheds are on, so we know that it's one of those in the top half that are actually creating the problem. So what I need to do now is I need to escape again. We need to don't save. Most important, don't save your game again. Quit. Do you want to quit without saving? Yes, that's the most important thing. Otherwise you lose the mods that you, that you have deselected that may be okay. Right, and then we go into Korea again. Right, so we know that when we deselected the, the top half, we know that the problem mod is in the top half. So from the herdsman stick to the beginning of our mod list. So let's deselect half of those. So if we deselect that, that. So from herdsman stick to financing, if we deselect that and start the game, let's see what happens. And we can see now that we do have our, our building, building options showing so we would be able to do some building so we now know that the problem mod is between 
the herdsman stick and financing. So let's escape and we'll get out of the game and we will then exit once again don't save the game quit the game yes right so what we know now if we go in here is that everything at the top here up to financing Financing. That's it. I didn't really go halfway, but still, it's a bit of luck there. So financing. So financing was deselected. So we know that between there and the herdsman stick, there, we have the problem. Right. So if we deselect half of those again. You select the herdsman stick, the headlamp, the haystack, right, so if we deselect those now and we start up and we'll see what happens. And we go in and have a look and see. Right, so now we know it's between financing and the the wood the wood mod. Can't quite remember what it's called that we have the problem because it's so we're now really narrowing it down. So if we escape and we get out of here again. So once again, don't save, quit. Yes. Go back into Korea. Right, so now we know It's always a question of just remembering where you are and wh what you've deselected and what you haven't. So if you do it by halves, it's quicker. I should have done a bit more in this last one. But, right, so where's financing? So, yeah. so we know that the problem lies between financing, between that mod, that mod, that mod, that mod, and this mod, yeah, so we're down to one, two, three, four, five mods that are the problem. So we'll start deselecting. So let's go this one. We we'll take this one out. That one out. So we'll do those first three. So it's enough. What will be left will be free water and the greenhouse wood out of that section. So we're not looking at all these others, we've already cleared all the others. So let's start and see if we've got the same problem. So we'll start. And we'll start again. Right, let's have a look and see. Right, so we've got a problem. So we know it's one of those two now. So it's either the greenhouse wood mod or The water, the, uh, the water mod. So let's exit again. Don't save the game. I must say that every time afterwards because I want to make sure. I don't want anybody losing all their mods by doing this. It's either free water tank or greenhouse wood because those are, those are the only two that we didn't have selected. So let's start at the top. Let's deselect that one. We start the game up and let's have a look and see. 
Right, so we still have the problem. So that leaves the greenhouse wood mod that is creating the problem. So we've now isolated that down to there. So let's get out of the game. All right, so now we have to go down to greenhouse wood mod. There it is there. We'll de delete that. Start. Right, we should be getting back into the game now. Once we've deselected the greenhouse wood mod. Right, so now we're back into the game and we've deselected the greenhouse wood mod. Let's see what happens. And then we're back in there. So now we know that the greenhouse wood mod was creating our problem. So in this case, once we've exited here, is we will go get out of the game again. In this case, we will save the game. And then we'll quit the game. I suppose you could continue playing the game. Yes, there we go. And now, if we go back into the game, we should not have a problem. Start up again. go and if we do a build mode there we go so we know we've isolated that there is obviously some major problem but that is a fix of sorts for now and also a way to find out if you just generally have a mod conflict I hope you found this informative if you have please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one Cheerio.